To embroider eyes on your amigurumi, take about an arm's length of yarn and thread it through a tapestry needle. Now, put the needle somewhere into the side of your body and pull it out wherever you want the top of the right eye to be. And pull until you have about a six inch yarn tail left. Now define the bottom of the right eye by putting your needle in one round below and then pull your needle up in exactly the same spot that the yarn tail is currently coming out of. Pull tight. And repeat this about three or four times until the eye is as big as you want. So stick the needle in the bottom of the eye, pull it out at the top of the eye. That's number two. If you get stuffing caught up in it like mine, just pull it out and away. Okay. And I did it three times. I actually like how that looks. So I'm going to move on to the left eye. I'm going to stick my needle into the bottom of the right eye and then pull it out wherever I want the top of the left eye to be. Let's say the pattern said that the eyes should be four stitches away from each other. The way that you can tell is by counting these holes because that marks the end of a stitch. And a stitch, if you wanted to look for it, looks like these upside down Vs. So this is one stitch away from the current eye. Here's two, three, four. So I'm gonna remember that spot, stick my needle in the bottom of the right eye and pull it out four stitches away to define the top of the left eye. One, two, three, four, which is over here. And pull tight. And repeat that with the left eye. So stick to the needle where we want the bottom of the left eye to be, pull it out at the top of the left eye again, pull tight and do this a few times. Ideally the same number of times as you did it to the right eye. So I did it three times. All right, and now to finish it, I'm gonna stick my needle in the bottom of the left eye and pull it out where the yarn tail currently is coming out of. This is where I originally stuck my needle. Then I'm gonna tie a knot with both yarn tails as close to the surface as possible. Thread the second yarn tail through the needle in the same direction. Trim the longer yarn tail to make it a little more manageable. And now put my needle in the same hole that both yarn tails are coming out of and pull it out somewhere on the other side of the piece. So now last thing we gotta do is cut these yarn tails as close to the surface of the body as possible. And if there's any yarn tail still poking out, just massage it until it disappears. And here you've got embroidered eyes.